Hey guys, welcome back to my channel. So, for the moisturizer and the primer, I will use the Quick Effects, the Tinted Moisturizer, and the Quick Effects Mattifier Primer. So, tacky yung finish ng moisturizer and silicone naman yung texture ng um, primer. So, here. Then, for my base, I will use Japanese brands na DD and BB Cream since I really need a white base, as in white base on this makeup look. And, ayan, ganyan siya kaputi mga best. And, I think available to online yung mga ganitong klase ng BB Cream. For the concealer, I will use the Maybelline Fit Me Concealer in the shade Light. So, ilalagay ko na lang sa description box yung mga gagamitin ko na product and kung magkano sila. So, dilagay ko lang siya sa high points of my face and blend it using my fingers para ma-maximize ko yung kanyang coverage. For the setting powder, I will use my Nichido in the shade Creamy Glow. And pang set ko lang siya all over my face para mawala yung shine ng BB Cream sa pagmumuka ko. I will bake underneath, underneath, <laughs> underneath my eyes kasi baka magiging tayo ng bonggang fallout for the eyeshadow. So, it's okay to be safe than to be sorry. So, yan. And, ang pangkiri na gagamitin ko as usual is the LA Girl Gel Eyeliner in the shade Brown. And, for this look, we really need to make the brows so thick and on fleek. As in, thick and fleek talaga like that girl. So, ayan. <laughs> Sinet ko lang siya with a um, brow cara. So, for the eyeshadow, I will use my must have palette by Beauty Glaze. And, kinuha ko lang yung isang light brown na transition shade. And, I will put it on my crease first and spread it all over my lids. Next shade is this um, must deeper na shade of brown. And I will just put it on my crease on it, focusing it on the crease and using a circular motions para spread yung color sa aking eyelid. And I'm just blending it with the uh, light brown kanina. Then I'm just getting a smaller brush and getting this black shade right here. And focus it on my outer part ng aking eyelid just to deepen out the color. And as you can see, sobrang intense ang ating eyeshadow ngayon. Then, I will just get the foil na gold shade on the palette using my fingers. And I will put it on my inner corners and blend it later with the lightest brown shade kanina. So, sobrang intense ang eyeshadow kasi kailangan kitang kita talaga siya. I will use the lightest brown shade as well on my lower lash line and I will put it on my lower lash line. Next shade is that black shade kanina and I will put it dito lang sa may dulong part ng aking eyes para lang magkaroon lang ng konting shallow dyan and hindi ko siya e parang um, ilalagay. Hanggang sa pinakonohan. Diyan nang talaga siya nakafocus. Then, gamitin ko yung Nietzsche Donna Silver Eyeliner to waterline my eyes. Then, kukunin ko yung Detail Makeover Metallics na palette and I will get the shade Polux and I will highlight my inner corners and dragging it down hanging sa half part ng aking lower lash line just to highlight the eyes kasi wala ako nung silver shade na ginagamit nila so ayan na lang then gagamitin ko yung detail makeover na liquid eyeliner in the shade matte for my eyeliner and I will do a konting dramatic na eyeliner lang naman so, ayan. Super black niya, guys. As in, black na black. 
Then, naglagay na ako ng falsies and I will use Fashion 21 Double Up Mascara for the lower lash line. For my contour, alam niyo na to, as usual, the detail makeover 4-in-1 palette. And I will use the bronze shade and the contour shade sa may babang part. And ayun na yung gagamitin ko para iscalp yung aking face. I will use the pink one na blush for today's blush kasi gusto natin yung parang patok na patok, patok na patok, or putok na putok na blush for this look. And I will use the highlight on the palette as well. For my lipstick, I will use the Beauty Natural in the shade Bury It All. It's a very beautiful nude na lipstick and bagay na bagay siya on this look.